When I was in second grade, they read us a story called The Green Ribbon. Well, it may just seem like a little kid story, but it's not. It's about this girl who wears a green ribbon and this guy named Alfred. And her, the girl's name is Jenny, the guy's name is Alfred. And she's always wearing this green ribbon and Alfred's always asking her, Are you going to tell me the secret about the uh, about the green ribbon, what's, which is around her neck? She, and then she's like, no, I'm not going to tell you. They get married. He's just like, now since we're married, can, can you tell me the secret that you have your green ribbon? She says no. And then at the end... She's uh, she's an a old lady in a bed, and they're both old. And he's just like, and she's just like, Alfred, I'm gonna tell you the secret of the green ribbon. Uh, so can you please untie, untie the ribbon? So he does, and her head comes off. Now that might be just like a like, eh, that's not very scary. But when they read that to me in second grade, I couldn't handle it. Like it was it just freaked me out. You'd have to like read the story for yourself, but it's a very short story. Um, they read it to me in second grade. Like, I went to the bathroom and then I just collapsed. I passed out. That was a freaky story. You would have to look it up. This that's, that's on YouTube. I looked it up. Like, I was just like, what, what was that story that used to freak me out? The green ribbon. Look up the green ribbon, guys. Because when I was in school, I passed out. They, I had to end up going home because I passed out. I ended up feeling better when I got when I left, but yeah, that story freaked me out and it made me pass out at school. Like, why would they read that to us? Like, that's not a kid's story, especially in the second grade. I, I, mean, I guess if we were older, maybe like, a, like the fifth grade, maybe. But in second grade, come on, why would they read that to us? That's the school system for you. Alright guys, you guys remember that story? Let me know down in the comments down below. It was just a weird, freaky story that really should have been told to a second grader. But whatever. Alright guys, hope you guys are enjoying your day. And I'll see you next time.